Hello friends, this is Ashok and today we are going to show you how to create custom name servers at name.com. For this, first login into name.com dashboard and click on domain. Now look for the NS registration. This will help you to register your NS records. Enter NS1 here and for IP address you need to contact your web hosting provider. In this case, I am using Domain Dresser. Now open a Domain Dresser in New tab. Click on Services. Open the Active Service and scroll down. Here you can able to see the name servers along with the IP address. In this case, I am using this IP address. Copy this and paste it into the IP section. So here we are registering first name server. Similarly, do for the second one. and copy the second IP and paste here so here we had created three different name servers that is ns1.domainname.com ns2 ns3 now the second part is remaining that is do the DNS configuration from web hosting end for this we have to login into WHM panel before that Subscribe to Domain Dresser to get videos on your request. Again, go back to the Domain Dresser dashboard and look for the login to WHM panel. Click here. Now we have successfully logged into WHM panel. Now from left side, enter DNS and look for DNS editor. Select your particular domain, scroll down and click on edit. Please watch this video carefully because a single mistake will cause serious issue to your website. Just scroll down, enter NS1 here, NS2, NS3 and select A records for all and enter the respective IP addresses. So these three entries are the DNS entries for your name server. Now go upside and replace the default name server with your own domain name. Please make sure that you have to enter dot at the end. Now scroll down and click on save option. Please make sure that you have to re-verify the settings. For this again go to the edit DNS zone edit and then select particular domain and click on edit. Now we are going to re-verify it. Here we have to check everything has been set properly as per the previous settings. So I can able to see that the everything has been properly set. Now the last setting is to update the name servers at domain provider. So in this case we are using name.com. Just go to the name.com dashboard and click on name servers and enter your name servers here so in this case i am deleting all these previous default name servers and enter the new name servers here and click on apply changes this way we have successfully created custom name servers for our domain if you have any doubts or suggestions you can able to comment below press the bell icon on youtube app and never miss another update